Good morning, swans, and uh, welcome to this week's podcast. This time, we're going to do something a bit different and hopefully a bit more fun and interesting for everyone, as it's uh, the last podcast of uh, this 2020. Let's hope 2021 is a better year. I think we can all agree that 2020 hasn't been the best year. But let's go around the school asking some people what their favourite part of 2020 has been. Miss Natalie, this year um, our family bought a house here in Spain, which is quite exciting, um, and moved in and we're all settled. So that was a good thing for 2020. Mr AJ went on honeymoon even though he didn't get married. Samuel Recky has told me to say that the, one of the important things which has happened this year is that the UK is finally leaving the undemocratic European Union. Thank you, Recky. Hello, I'm Mr Chamberlain. Well, a good thing that's happened to me this year is that my football team finally have a good manager in Carlo Ancelotti. A good thing that's happened for me this year is my family have stayed safe during this horrendous COVID season. Hello everybody, my name is Ronnie Masri. So in the coming year, I plan to go to Cambridge for a summer school. Uh, I entered this writing competition last year and I got a 15% scholarship to a summer school in medicine. So I'm really excited to see if I can do that this uh, the coming year because obviously I couldn't do it this year. Me llamo Rocío y bueno, algo bueno que me haya pasado este año es que mi niño ha empezado a andar y está empezando a hablar y está sano. Hola, soy, soy señorita Carmen y creo que algo muy muy bueno que ha podido pasar este año es que Donald Trump haya perdido las elecciones. Okay, my name is Mr. Ian. I just like some good news. My son Finlay Lockyer is captain of the national uh, under 19 Marbella football team. Great news. And hopefully we'll become a professional next season. So, I am Mr. King, and something that's good that's happened to me this year, it's, it's double-edged, in a good way. So, the first thing was, the day after we went onto lockdown, I remember thinking, and it was scary, and I was walking out on the street going to the supermarket, thinking, obviously, I'm a film studies teacher, and it felt a bit, a little bit like a film that I've seen set in London, which I'm not going to say the name of, but it's not a nice film. And I was on the phone to my mum, I think, and I said, Mum, I'm going to have to go. There's lots of police cars zooming round. And it was quite spooky, and I didn't like that. But at the very end of lockdown, um, a lovely memory I have is myself, Miss Sandra, and Miss Kate. We made the video for the year 13s. And I was saying to Miss Kate, this is so beautiful and optimistic because we got through lockdown and it was coming to an end. We made this beautiful video and all the teachers made this lovely video for the year 13s. And I just thought, well, that's a nice way to finish what's been a really hard year. Hello, my name is Severino Bonvini and one big thing that happened to me this year was my taking part in, the f in one of my first uh, really big debate competitions. Um, I thought it was an amazing experience and obviously I've learned lots and improved overall as a person. Hola, soy Amanda y he aprobado dos exámenes de sociales este año. Hola, soy Nico. No he sacado ningún negativo francés. Hello, my name is Hector, and something I like this of this year is that now every time we have PE, we can come with our PE kit into school the from the first morning day. Miss Kate, um, I've just witnessed two year nines sing beautiful harmonies in the song My Child from Blood Brothers, Julia and Alejandra. And it was a lovely moment in my life and my career. So there's lots of positives to look forward to in life. Hi, my name is Thomas Bradburn Perez Edward. And during quarantine last year, well, during this year, my grades went up because I felt more comfortable in the homes of my comfort. And I think this is one of the reasons why quarantine was actually good for me because my grades went up. Uh, yeah. Hello, I'm Javi, and I'm proud of being in the debate club for Swan School International. I got a motorbike, I don't know, man. Camille. Hi, I'm Nika, and I sang All I Want for Christmas for Mr. Tim, and he liked it. Hello, I'm Tyra, and I got 500% of my target. Hola, me llamo Dulce, y me ha mejorado la espalda, y estoy muy contenta porque me, esfuerzo, me sigo esforzando. Hola, soy Don David y algo bueno que me haya pasado este año es que toda mi familia está bien. 
Soy Don Juan y lo bueno que me ha pasado este año es que a pesar de la enfermedad ningún miembro de mi familia se ha sido contagiado. My name is Simon. I won a go-kart race this weekend. Really fun. I, I enjoyed it a lot because it was my first race. Hello, my name is Miss Kira, and something great that's happened to me this year is coming back to Swans. Yay! Hi, my name is Mr. Darren, and something that's good happened to me this year is that I started teaching at Swans. I'm gonna play this alt tape. No, just, <laughs> just say it. I don't want to. I'm scared. You are. <laughs> Wait, can you just clarify what? Oh. What is it? Pause it. No, I don't want to. No, no, no. So I just no, say it. No way. You Why? gotta keep this. Sir, it's gonna get cut. Cut it now. I can't cut it now. How can't you cut it now? It's terrible phone. As we know, everyone's had a tough year. But again, as we have seen, there are some positives. And now, before we finish off with 2020, let's just think about what's going to come in 2021. Let's see what students of Swans think. Um, hello, I'm Shahina Shvita. In the coming year, I'll be working in a computer science company to help them develop an application as a sort of intern before going to university. Hi, my name's Axel. Um, what I'm looking forward to next year is finally turning 18 and having a large birthday party where I can see all my friends and family. So for 2021, what am I looking forward to? Well, I'm going to be 50 in 2021, which is a bit depressing. I need to be positive. Um, but I'm looking forward to the Olympics. I'm looking for, forward to the Euros. I'm looking forward to science. Um, trouncing. Nonsense conspiracy theories. And I'm looking, therefore, I'm looking forward to a world that accepts that science is knows best in many respects and that we're going to be using the vaccine and that hopefully will make our lives a little bit easier and a little bit better and start to improve things. Okay, my name is Shade and a good thing that's going to happen is my brother and my sister are coming for Christmas. Hi, my name is Gil and I'm going to win the lottery. Hi, my name's Maria and next year my brother's moving out so yay. Hi, I'm Mr. Tim, and I can't wait to get him back to be able to do practical music in school and doing some gigs. Thank you to everyone who took part in this interview. I think it's done for a great podcast to end this 2020 on a high note. So, yeah, Merry Christmas to everyone, and let's hope that 2021 is um, a better year. So, again, Merry Christmas and uh, have a Happy New Year. See you next year.